That is amazing. That was like um, patch 1.13 or something like that? 1.0.5, I think, was post-patch Diddy Kong. Because it's the first one after Wii U came out. Oh, oh, well, zero five. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, so like Wii U, and then they did pass Diddy Kong, so it's 1.0.5. All right, let's jump into this game here. Losers finals, best two of three set. Oh, get to the floor, get to the floor. That's the camera mechanic I just talked about, and he exploded. Yes. The, the set just started. Yeah. Okay. Ten seconds in, baby. I like it. I dig it, Ray. I see I am, you, Ray. I am all for the 10 second explosions. Let's go, Ray. He wants to do it again. Look at him. He's like, I'm going to hit Fading you again. So as I was saying, this is uh, game two of the, of the second. It might as well be. My man, yeah. Ray, just opened up hard on Ray. Yeah, that is, I mean, that is a statement and a half, and he is already getting a lap in percentage. Although, again, as I mentioned earlier, Mega Man, if he is good at one thing, it is racking the damage and keeping you at a distance. And if King can do that consistently for a full stock, and you're not take, not take too much damage, if he can stay around like 70 this stock, he's not in too bad of a position. All right, good catch on that jump out of shield. Bear? Okay, it goes for the upper. So you see where are you going for these warps, trying to cancel them on those platforms. Good call out from King Ark. Oh, I love it. Again, but that is a lot less unlike in this game than it did in 4. Mm -hmm. So... Not in time. You really have to do that preemptively. You can't do it on reaction in this game. Yeah, I mean, and, and also, he didn't even go for the platform cancel. It still yeah. doesn't have that much. 123%. Where is he going to go? Trying to get back on that stage. Kinar trying to get all these options covered with the forward smash and the no back jump. air. Okay, it doesn't end up getting punished for it. Yeah, get that oh. mine off you. Nice. I, I, that I respect great. that option. Go for the grab because you get some invincible. <gasps> Did he? That no, was there's no Mensa. way. He ran that up. was so Mensa. <laughs> he crouched to make him get stuck <laughs> with the Crasher Bomb. That's, that was 3,000 IQ. That was House funny. Thousand IQ. Honestly, that, that was that was pretty funny. Just going to go for the simple back throw. Just toss my mans into the blast zone. I'm Three so stocks to one. I'm so glad he got rewarded for that. Yes. Like, if you took like, a screenshot of that moment, you could, t you could definitely <laughs> tell that she was smirking as she was crashing. Yeah. Ooh. 134% gonna avoid that spike from the down air. Here we go. The neutral air train begins. And this is already 37%. 49. That's a deficit and a half, if I can say so myself. Yeah. Th th this game's game, over. Game th two, there's game no. Two, game two, baby. Yeah, just bring on games. There's just, no just, way. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought he was gonna SD. Oh, well. All right. Get the stock. Now run off. It's still looking pretty bleak for King yeah. Ark. He's at 121%. Avoids throw. the explosion. So, like, the initial grab didn't transfer the crash bomb, but the F throw extending her hurtbox forward ended up doing so. So, it's a good choice by Ray. And Ray's trying to pop up King Ark with these down tilts, trying to get that follow up, the conversion yeah. afterwards. Up air bear, and we're going to actually see a bear right there. No follow up needed. That is a good enough move on its own. The thing is. Venia, not Venia, I'm sorry. Uh, this Utopian Ray was playing out of his mind when he's fighting against Venia in Winter Semis. Yeah. So he's carrying that energy into these sets, taking out Dill, looking to be on course to taking out King Ark. Maybe he can carry that energy once he goes into Grand Finals and try to yeah. reset the bracket. But I don't want to, I don't want to sleep on King Ark just yet, man. Like yeah. he could easily adapt in this game number two. He's got to change up the game plan just a little bit. I feel like he let. Ray kind of steamrolling in the beginning of that first game. Yeah, I mean, it was kind of an unfortunate situation, as I mentioned. Mega Man limited off the stage, and Ray was like, yeah, he is, and I'm going to kill him for it. Um, I love this counter pick. I think Mega Man's great on tripods in general. Um, and the slants, I can only imagine uh, just King Ark will prefer. Oh, and he counter picked the stage last week as well during Grand. So. Yeah. Another important thing for Mega Man on the stage is the fact that they have solid walls yeah. off stage. It allows him to get really easy down air spikes yeah. as well as you know throw the metal plate against the wall. And a mix up as well mm, with wall jumps. Uh, wall jumps. So that yes, is sir. huge for Mega Man. That's why Mega Man very often will counter pick to a Kalos or a uh, Yoshi story. However, a much more solid start, I would say, for King Ark. You know, not dying at 30 in the beginning of the game is pretty solid. Um, but however, Ray is still showing his prowess on offense and almost taking a stock right there with a potential uh, fair. Oh? He tries to go for the Trump, had a back air waiting for him. Good reaction from Ray. Ooh, I was looking for back air there. However, Metal Blade's in the direction that I don't think Ray was anticipating. Yeah. And uh, Honestly. back in. Uh, oh, he tried to murder him. He tried. He got murdered for it, but I like yeah. the attempt. He got sent to heaven. Ooh. We got the forward tilt coming from Ray. Good stage presence coming from Ray, not allowing King Ark any sort of uh, retail to stay. Oh, but wait a sec. Off stage, 94%. Looking for back air. Yeah, catches the jump. King Ark is so good. One thing I noticed, he is so good at calling out the mix up when you jump and just backing it on reaction. I think his reaction time must be like insane for how consistently he does that. Yeah, let's Ooh, get it. Ooh, it's off. 
Each that, other footstool will kill him. Mm. Looking pretty bleak. Fair. He goes for the forward air instead. That move is going to kill in this game compared yeah. to the last one. It is so. a huge buff. Got to look out for that sword that is on flames. Ooh. That's an air. That's a fair. And uh, nice. Good spacing from King Arc, avoiding the down tilt. That destroying hitbox goes pretty far, especially on the slant of Yoshi's mm -hmm. story. And there, uh, there was no respect needed by Ray. Ooh, I was looking for a Rar Bear, but he doesn't like getting crash bomb stuck to him. And he's going to get. Uh, Back to stage because of that. He went for the trade. You know, he yeah. traded the auto reticle for the explosion. Honestly, when you have a lead, why not? Yeah, you know, you, again, one of the oldest rules in Smash is if you have a lead, do not be afraid to trade. Because why would you? You're in the lead. You, trades are always in your favor. Okay, good DI from Ray. Gonna avoid that follow up from King Art. That's a lot of damage. Gets the up air train going. Well. He went super high for that back air. Fair, that's gonna be enough. Just catch him with the shield on that platform. Oh, he was like, you better not hold block any longer. You're exploding. Now, King Ark, your first place finisher last week on the cusp of getting third at the hands of Utopian Ray. Can he pull this back? Metal Blade's a good start. Pressure on block. Looks for a roll. Doesn't get it. And that's a lot of damage. Yeah, meaty punish. And that damage is starting to get higher and higher. King Ark's guy close out the stock. Oh, great tech, tech coming oh, out from okay. Ray. Not able to survive. Looks like that was a missed input yeah, after the tech. Buffer the, uh, the, uh, Air dodge afterward because yeah. you know, trying to you know mash air dodge in that situation to take the stage, and unfortunately cost him a stock. However, seventy percent is nothing to scoff at in terms of a lead. And uh, Ray, we know how well he plays with the lead, and we're gonna see if he can continue that consistency here. He's got him at ninety-three percent. Oh, drag down doesn't end up actually getting anything off of it. Playing a lot of pressure with this back air. I like the attempt there. I'm trying to mix up the block with the uh, double jump near the floor. Back air is almost enough. He's got him off stage, charging up, sma up smash for a hot second. 118%. Oh, accidental tech stool. Stool? Back in. Oh, we take those, I guess. 132. Yeah. Up smash again. You see King Arc actually anticipating those this time around. Yeah, keep in mind, though, Metal Blade on the floor and two up tilt is a true confirm. Very close to Ray now. is hungry for these up smashes. Gets the leaf shield, a lot of damage. Gonna survive that dash that great DI avoids the explosive flame trying to get back onto the stage. He gives up stage control to go off stage against him with that neutral air. Yeah, and the knockback growth on back air is huge. So not back air at the ledge for Mega Man may very well just take a stock, but the invincibility comes in the clutch for Ray. Eats up the metal blade, and King Art will be out of the tournament at third. Gonna place. use that shield offensively and defensively. Says get away from me. Yeah, I mean, he went right through the Metal Blade, got the kill, and, and you know, your boy's gonna move on to Grand Finals. Utopian Ray gonna get, try to get this uh, run back against Venia, losing the first set, but now it's turned into a best two or three sets.